All right, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Uh, this is Abraham Oluwato Siadiemi, the Grape Family. Uh, today in my video, I will be answering your questions on Noila Chicken. Now. So my answers to your question uh, will be based on my experience uh, with Noila Chicken and I will be sharing some of the things that I have come to uh, learn about this, about this chicken. Now there are so many questions that maybe you have, maybe you are planning to raise Noila chicken, and uh, maybe you are thinking about starting one, or maybe you've already started and you have questions about your Noila chicken. I have about uh, seven or eight questions that I will be answering are concerning Noila chicken. So, the first question I will be answering concerning Noila chicken is how was Noila chicken made or how is Noila chicken made? So, the answer to this question is Noila chicken is uh, made by Hamo Hatchery and you know it is made from a uh, broiler and you know uh, from broiler and cockroach according uh, to my research so me personally I love to cook them and improve local chicken uh, because like the the differences between them is they are much uh, bigger uh, than you know, local chicken they grow faster than local chicken uh, than our Yoruba uh, chicken breed so that is you know that is the different but they are from Cochrane um, brother uh, chicken so that is how uh, Noila was breeded or that is how it was produced so if that is the first question about that so the second question is what uh, are the differences I may have to do the follow-up question I mean follow-up answer on that what are the differences between the broiler and the Noila chicken now uh, the broiler uh, predominantly they are white in color but Noila chickens they have different uh, colors so broiler uh, can only be used for meat purpose but you know Noila has dual uh, purposes you can use it for meat uh, you know you can use it for egg uh, production uh, if you want to go into egg production now Noila chicken they are, are more stronger in terms of resistance to uh, disease but you know what broiler you have to make sure you take care of them very well they can die uh, at the snap of, of, of a finger uh, so and, and also uh, broiler chicken you know their meat is more uh, tougher but then the noila chicken their meat is more uh, tender if you have eaten uh, noila chicken so I can compare the meat together because uh, the meat uh, tastes uh, different uh, to each other so those uh, that is another question so the, the top question is how long does it take for noila chicken okay how long does it take for noila chicken to mature now it takes uh, 13 weeks uh, for noila chicken uh, to mature so if you are raising noila chicken from day hold if you are raising noila chicken from day hold it takes uh, approximately uh, 13 months before it mature before you can uh, slaughter uh, the uh, the the male okay and then the bro I mean the the female it takes about five months before uh, the female uh, will start laying eggs so another question is what do the Nola chicken hit now you are asking maybe you're asking this question because you want to uh, start with I mean you uh, you have low budget but let me say this to you Nola chicken they are very easy to manage they feed on uh, leftover food they feed on vegetables they feed on corn millets and also you know you can buy feed for them if you have that money but you know what the feed is not uh, that kind of necessary uh, for them to you know for them to reach uh, the maturity and they can they will they eat leftover and waste food and people feed them on I mean bread uh, you know waste bread uh, you know uh, waste bread waste cake and many other anything that is left to our vegetables you know 
uh, which uh, people feed them on that. So another question is, do Noila hatch their eggs? Now that is one of the question most search question. A lot of people they they I mean a lot of people want to know whether Noila chickens they hatch uh, their eggs. But the answer is no, they do not hatch their eggs because they do not sit. When they lay eggs, they live and they do not sit on their eggs. Now, if you want to hatch Noila chicken, you can buy the one that has been, you know, uh, incubated and hatch it, or you can take their eggs and put it under uh, a local chicken that's, that's already laid and ready to, you know, to hatch eggs. So, that is how people have been doing it now. Now, someone actually said that their Noila chicken lay, I mean, lay eggs and hatch them. But if you have different experience, I'm okay. I'm not going to dispute that with you. You know, everyone has his own experience. So, from my side, and according to other people, Noila chicken uh, do not sit on their eggs to incubate it and to hatch it. All right. Now the question is, how many eggs? Uh, how many eggs do the Noila chicken lay per you know per day? A. Depending on the quality of feed that you are giving to them, if you are feeding them well. Now another thing about Noila chicken, they do not need vaccine before they start laying eggs. Once they reach the mature age for them to be laying, they will continue to lay every day. But then sometimes they stop laying. For example, our Noila chicken, uh, for the past uh, five days. Uh, she has not been laying okay maybe stop for a while so they do not lay throughout the year all right but another thing that people have proven to be right is when you give them uh, wheat bread and some leftover food they continue to lay here throughout the year so uh, they lay one per day and I have testified I've picked many of the eggs one per day I mean that is how Delay just like uh, laying birds to the layers. So when they start laying, they lay one per day. So another question is this: uh, Is grower feed good for Noila? Well, I told you. I, mean, I told you that you know they can eat anything. All right, Noila chickens, like local uh, chicken, they can eat anything. So you know you can feed them on anything. Now another another question is. What kind of cage is good for my Nola chicken? Now they can uh, they can use any cage, I mean litter, battery, uh, free range. Okay, you put them on the floor, they do well. Uh, great, that is why I call them improved local chicken. They do well when you put them on the floor. You free range them. They pick insects, they pick grass, they eat grass, and you know they roam around. You know they are good with that. Um, I've seen so many people uh, who. Uh, into free range noila chicken, they free range their noila chicken and they enjoy the freedom to walk around to pick insects, you know. And they just feed them once in the, in the day, 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. in the morning. Uh, they are ready to eat their food and then they go about their normal uh, day. So, another question here we have another question What is the best feed for noila chicken? Now, noila chicken, we actually eat anything, okay. Uh, the best feed for Noila chicken, you know, is you know, vegetables, leftover food, millet, corn, maize, uh, no, whatever feed that you know you think you can give to Noil. I mean, layers or I mean, they can feed on any uh, any feed. All right. But my best advice is, you know, it's better for you to put them on the floor, let them pick instead, let them pick whatsoever they want to pick, and it is good for them. And you know what? try it you know experiment, experiment them try them and try to do your own thing with them what's the difference between the normal chicken and the local chicken now the local chicken is our nigerian breed type all right uh, made in nigeria locally and a nigerian breed all right uh, sometimes they are called white chicken all right but then the noila is different is made from broiler and cockroach and i call them improve local chicken so they look alike you know but you know you can just notice some things what are the differences between them now noila chicken they don't hatch eggs but local chicken they had hatch their own eggs noila chicken their eggs are more bigger but local chicken their eggs are 
smaller. No, 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 no chicken, their heads are more, uh, you know, brownish, but local chicken, their heads are more whitish. Uh, so those are the uh, differences uh, between the local chicken and Nola and many other differences that I've shared with you uh, before you can look at them and see the comparison but similarity is that they pick instead they do well on the floor they do well on free range they eat anything those are the similarity between them so those are the questions that we have and thank you so much for watching uh, this YouTube channel there are so many videos that I've made on Nola chicken so if you want to explore through the channel or you, if there is a question that I have not answered, that you, you know, may, you may want me to answer or give an insight to that or to share my experience with that, I will be willing to, you know, uh, share with you my thoughts if I know uh, the answer. All right. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please, if you have not subscribed to this channel, subscribe to my channel, and I'm going to see you next time in my video. Peace be unto you.